नमस्कार मैं हूं डॉक्टर अन्नपूर्णा सिंह और आज मैं आपके साथ अपने सस्टेनेबल लिविंग का एक हिस्सा अपना सस्टेनेबल गार्डन शेयर करना चाहती हूं उससे पहले आई वांट टू विश यू ऑल अ वेरी हैप्पी वर्ल्ड अर्थ डे सो ऑन द ओकेजन ऑफ वर्ल्ड अर्थ डे आई वांट टू शेयर अ पार्ट ऑफ माई सस्टेनेबल लिविंग माई सस्टेनेबल गार्डन विथ यू सो लेट स्टार्ट I have some beautiful sunflowers in my garden. The sunflower buds are all ready to bloom. They haven't bloomed yet, but they are all ready to bloom. Then there is this enigmatic palm, grassy plant, um, whose name I'm escaping. Then there is this lavender lilies. I love them. Again, some sunflowers, money plant. Then again, an enigmatic plant whose name I'm escaping. then that's a snake plant or sansevieria then this is my um this is my aloe vera money plant and other plants this is a plant that cannot survive a lot of sunlight so that's always kept in a shade this is my lavender plant still waiting for flowers in this plant these are some succulents then there's the road view from my balcony that's my favorite morning glories then this is these are tomatoes which i which i just sowed a week ago this is my marigold collection yellow and orange that's again succulents this is fern i'm trying to cultivate that's aparajita an indian plant very uh, auspicious again a variety of succulent then this is sadabahar uh again these are daisies This is also white sada bahar, white periwinkle, as they are called in English. Then hibiscus, the species seed has sprouted and it's growing. Then these are some other plants. Again, a prajita and yellow daisies. As you can see, all of these pots are reused pots. These are actually yogurt containers, and I have covered them in brown paper so that they look uniform. This is a container from my. this was a detergent so it got it had like 60 pots and the container got empty after 2 months and i covered them with them with brown paper all of these ba all of these containers are either empty containers from like corn starch empty milk containers i cut the milk bottle in half and put soil in them and then i sowed hibiscus seeds then this this container has actually been reused i got it from a This is a Halloween container. I got it from a a vintage store. This is again, this is again a reused yogurt container. Then this is a reused container which I was using in my kitchen, and now I have potted succulents in them, the red one. And these are all Halloween buckets. I planted uh, marigolds in them. These are again used yogurt containers, used dishwasher detergent containers. This is a used lamp shade that I used, and not just this. All these sunflower containers are used yogurt containers. So the whole purpose of me showing you why I'm using all these yogurt containers is because if I was not using all these yogurt containers, then all of them would have. and dead in my trash and clearly your your waste enters your trash and your trash enters the landfill and land is a scarce resource we shouldn't be wasting there are so many people wanting to live on that piece of land that goes waste when it's used for a landfill and that's the reason why i always used use uh, and re reduce reuse and recycle everything that i can like this grocery like this grocery bag here so this was the gro grocery bag that i used to cover all my pots in brown sheets of paper so i not only reuse the grocery bags i reused yogurt containers i used reused dishwasher detergent containers and i reused everything that i could use i reused soda glasses which which i got for a party and there were leftover soda glasses so 
so i reused all of those and that way i was able to save a lot of waste from ending into the landfill so we environmentalists not only preach the three r's that is reduce re reuse and recycle we also live it so by reduce i mean buy stuff that you need but don't buy stuff that you don't need and it's just for show and you will never be using it so buy only what you will use that's reduce reuse is like i reused all these yogurt containers so these were waste but i reused them and they made beautiful garden pots for me so that's reuse then comes recycle so there's a recycle bin at the bottom at the at my apartment and we put all our recycle recycle recyclable stuff in that bin also there's a brand called H&M and that's in US as well as in India and they take old clothes and they recycle them so I shop at H&M twice a year at least and I give them all my old clothes my baby's old clothes to recycle and the bonus is that they also give you like 15% discount on your purchase so um, I am assuming H&M is in India also and please find out if they do that in India also do they like if they take uh, clothes for recycling in India also then not just that whenever I have extra stuff like my baby which is who is four year old and she's growing very fast and every couple of months she has clothes that that are sh too short for her so I donate all those clothes to a thrift store or a church where others can use it so I try my best to reduce waste to, re to reuse everything I can and everything others can and donate stuff and to recycle everything that's possible. So that way I try to live a sustainable life and not only preach sustainability but also live sustainably. Thank you.